how to set up Quix booking step by step. Hey guys, welcome back and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to set up Wix bookings in this step-by-step -step tutorial. So Wix helps you create a secure and reliable website. Whether you're a self-creator, small business, or large organization owner, you can do it all with Wix. So one of its promising features is booking management. In this particular tutorial, I'm going to show you exactly how you can set up Wix bookings and receive booking appointments from your clients and other customers. So first, before you can actually um, access this particular dashboard that has a headline called My Sites, you may want to actually just create a new account of Quix so that you can easily um, access this dashboard. So it is pretty easy. You can just make a new account through your Google account, Facebook account, or you can also input your email and set your password and everything. So you can have your own Wix account. Next is we're going to explore this particular dashboard. So you have my sites um, tab, explore, help, and also hire a professional. If you want to hire a professional to build your website, you also have inbox right here. If you have messages from your customers, the notifications and other options right here, create new folder, create new site. And if you have created your site, you can also see them all listed here. So next we're actually going to click on this create new site right here and just wait for it to load. And we are redirected to the free website builder of Wix. So the kind of website we are creating is a booking site. So we're just going to type in booking site or booking agency. Just click on that particular category and just click on next. So since we have selected booking agency, it automatically adds the chat and bookings feature of Wix to your website. So if you scroll through, you can also add more tabs. So I'm just going to focus on adding bookings in this particular tutorial and just ignore all the other plugins. So you can just click on that if you also prefer a particular plugin. So let's just click on next and then you can choose how you want to create your website. So you can also use the Wix ADI to create a website for you. So this is when you can answer a few simple questions and automatically get a website design just for you in minutes. Or you can also create your website with the editor. So you can start with a template or make it your own. So for this tutorial, I'm just going to click on up for creating my own websites and edit a template right here. So I'm just going to scroll through all the pre-made templates by Wix and just going to choose any that I prefer and which I think is more appropriate to my product. So let's say I'm going to create a website for a nail salon to set up a booking website for my customers to get on. So maybe I'm just going to click on this beauty salon template right here and you can just click on edit after hovering over a template. So let's just click on that and wait for the template to load. So the Wix website editor is currently loading and this might take a while, but don't worry, it's just going to load after a few minutes or seconds. Now that our template has loaded, let us explore the Wix website editor so we can navigate through easily. So here you have the pages tab so you can um, track all your pages right here. It also has a, the save, preview and publish option right at the top, tool search. You can also zoom out or zoom in of your template so you can see everything on your website. And in this toolbar right here, you have many options such as menus and pages, add section, add elements, site design, add apps, media, start blogging, bookings, and ascend business tools. So in the pages section, let us click on this switch page option right here and just click on manage pages. After that, let's click on add page. And right here at the left part, you can click on the blank page option right here. So this is supposed to be our booking page. So let's just rename this page to bookings and just click on done. And let's exit this site pages manager. And after that, let's just rename the title site so that it will be more um, inclined to our service that you have thought. So I'm just going to name it Jane's Nail. Let's resize it right here so that is going to look better. And that looks pretty good now. So since we are at our bookings page, we can just click on from the left toolbar, we can just click on this add apps option right here. And let's wait for it to load. So from this Wix app market, we can search apps from right here. So we are intentionally wanting to get the Wix bookings app. So I'm just going to search for booking. Let's wait for it to load. So these are all the apps for 
your booking management and where your clients can book. So I actually recommend using this Wix bookings because it easily integrates with your website and is more compatible with your Wix website overall. So it is a scheduling platform, calendar, and online booking. So it's actually already installed. So I'm just going to click on open right here. And this manage services tab pops up and here you can manage your services. So just click on that option. So from the template, it actually added services itself. So you can also opt to keep this or you can also opt to delete a certain service if it is not compatible or appropriate for your website or the service you intend to um, deliver. So if you want to delete, just click on this three dots right here beside the service and just click on delete. So if you want to keep them, just don't move them or you can also edit them so you can change the title and all the other details according to your preference. So for example, if you don't have any um, services on this from your template, so just click on add a new service and then you can um, select from all these pre-made services that might be compatible with your business. So if you don't find any, you can just click on this option called start from scratch so you can edit all the details you want according to your preference and give all the details you want example since i am creating a website for a nail salon i'm going to have this service titled as acrylics extension so you can also add a service subtitle so the clients can know more about a particular service you can also add an image make sure to toggle on the visible on your site if you want to let the customers know that this particular service is currently available on your website to purchase so on the service type right here, you have appointment, class, or course. So appointment is a one-on-one -on -one session. A class is intended for multiple participants. And course is a complete set of sessions for multiple participants. So just click on whichever is more um, inclined to your preference. And as for the service details, since... is when you add a few minutes after each session to have a good way to create short breaks in between the services that you provide. So maybe like 10 minutes so you can rest a bit. So price per session, you can also opt to have it as a fixed price, custom price, and no fee if you want to give the service for free or if you don't want to display the price on your site. As for the amount, maybe let's put it at 25. You can also add in your location, your business address, your conferencing service availability so you can add a staff member so that the customers will know if staff members are available in a particular time. So you can add as much as many staff members you want. Click on create after you input their name. So you can also opt to show their service availability, the pricing plans, and more additional settings right here so you can get the booking service more detailed. So after you are done um, setting up your particular service, just click on save right here. So after you have set up your bookings page and your services, you can just click on your bookings right here and you can click on add booking elements so that it will show you options on which template you want to choose to show your services. So I'm just going to click on this particular template right here. So this will immediately load all your services that you input on the managing bookings before. So that is it. And just click on publish right here so that it will show on your website. So on the website, it looks like this. Go to bookings. And let's just reload it. And that shows all our services right here and the customers can click on book now if they want to book an appointment for that particular service and that actually ends this tutorial on how to set up Wix bookings and i hope this was helpful and make sure to follow on our channel so that you can see more videos in the future that is all for this video thank you all for watching